Yo, what's up boys? In today's video, I will be showing my Zim Matrix Rainbow 16 settings. Now, the settings are going to be displayed at the end and it will cover my in-game settings and maybe the in-app settings as well, I'm not quite sure yet. But I have got some clips to share with you guys before I actually go ahead and show you the settings. And also, there will be a video of me in T-Hunt as well, using the no recall feature on, on the Matrix. Alright, now as you can see we're in T hunt and this is the no recall. Now I know I know it's on the R4C but the recall is completely easy to control anyway, but this is just with the no recall on Ash. Now as you can see there's pretty much near to no recall there. Um this is literally just me in T hunt. Like you haven't got to watch this part, you can easily skip to the settings that are gonna be after this video, but this is just me walking by T hunt showing you uh literally me on the matrix. Um, I've been on it for about a week now. I don't plan on using it like as much as well because we're going back to PC. But you can see, it, it, it feels smooth when you get the right settings to it. Um, obviously I'm like within half my fucking shots, but you can see like how nice it feels. It feel it does feel nice when you get the right settings to it. Um, the no recall itself as well, like you can't just copy someone's recall settings. If you are Zim Matrix and you want to get uh, no recall, just go on the Zim website or the, the YouTube channel Zim Central and you can probably get it done easy. But I don't even need the no recall because I, I can control recall really easy anyway. But I thought I just needed to demonstrate. Um, yeah, as you can see, it's just like this was me just warming up. It's like it snaps on the people pretty well. Um, there's not really much of a difference to it, but like, with the Zen Apex, other than better SAB and obviously the recall control. There is no recall with it anyway. If you get the right send, you don't even need the no recall, in my opinion. Um, it's literally just like personal preference, I believe. But yeah, I'm literally just snapping on the heads. Like, well, not really actually. My aim's pretty, sh my aim's pretty terrible. But you can still like get the gist of it. Um, yeah. All right. So here's my in-game settings and sensitivity. Now, just for a disclaimer, I don't recommend you use my settings or sensitivity. It's just personal preference. These settings won't make you good, even though I'm nowhere near as good as maybe like the average player would think I am. I'm pretty terrible at the game. But here's my settings and sensitivity if any of you are interested. I do not recommend using any sort of Zim Matrix on Xbox or Rainbow Six Siege for that matter. But um, yeah, if you guys did enjoy the video, drop a like on the video, subscribe, and let me know if you want more videos like this in the future.